You know how at school sometimes you can't say the words in your brain, but you really want to? That's how I feel sometimes. So we're just going to crack straight in, into it. So, um, what was I going to say? Alright, so, um, so, you know, you've got like these deep concerns and deep feelings and, you know, your brain does, you know, your brain, you know, you, you, in the inside, you you want, you want to get mad and smash the table and just say, you know, swear words and stuff. That's how I feel, even though I'm not a swear person, which I already, um, not described, but described in my other videos. So, you know, but, you know, but for me, I guess I can release them at home, you know, where it's safe and sound. I mean, at school, you can't really... You know, you can't really say, oh, I don't like that girl because they'll, you could, because that, that, but that's actually bullying. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to stick with. But, um, you know, like, there are a lot of, not a lot of people, but just, you know, um, like, if, like, if someone's annoying you, for example, okay, there's this girl who's in year 11 this year who's leaving high school next year in year 12, so she'll be gone. You know, this is not the girl I was talking about from Canberra, you know, she's, whoosh, she's gone. So this, there's this girl at my school who's in year 11, and she repeats things, like, she's a nagging brat in my brain. Like, she's, you know how people get, you know, when they're so annoying and so obsessed with you. You know, actually, this girl from Canberra was so obsessed with me. She wanted to be my friend, but I didn't want to. Only because that she was so needy. I See, I think I talked about this in my in my previ previous videos. Like, I don't really like needy and attention people. It's just wrong. So, um, you know. She's always, she's nagging and stuff. I'm like, ugh, I don't like that you're nagging. And you want to say that out loud, but you can't because it's school and stuff. So, I guess it's not because of school. It's because of something else. But, you know, at, at least at, at my house, you can express yourself, you know, you can go mad, you can drive you crazy mad or something. So, that's that. Um, what else was I going to say? Oh, yeah, so when someone's really annoying you, your brain just, like, goes on a backfire, you know? But on the outside, you've kind of calm, you know, very calm and stuff. Like, for me, I don't have anger problems or an anger temper, like you might guys do. But I don't have an anger problem. I just, anger's like inside of me. Like I get really angry inside, but not outside, which is kind of a good thing, you know. Because there are some people in my class who get anger issues outside, you know. And some people do not get along, you know. In my classroom, some people do not get along, which is very sad. But it's actually true, you know. Some people don't really get along with others, which is kind of sad and endearing, but it's true, you know. You know, but that's what we're talking about. You know, when someone really is nagging to you, you're like, yes, okay. Oh, a brass drawing. I'm like, yes, okay, sure, no problem. But on the inside, you're like, oh, I just want to fix you, fight you with something. Like, you know, with those aggression words, like, that's from the inside. But on the outside, you're truly really calm and stuff. But, you know, just something doesn't seem right, okay? So, um, yeah, that's all I've got time for like and subscribe and i'll see you all next time